Hello Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I hope you're all having a fabulous day. I'm going to take a look and see what's manifesting for you all for the rest of the month. Any messages, advice, what's showing up around you as well. Don't forget to practice using your discernment. Take what resonates and leave out the rest. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram. I am Spiritually Goldie on all platforms. If you are interested in a personal reading done by me, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all. The link to my website spirituallygoldie.com for you to view all of the different options for readings. Okay. We got the moon and the high priestess. So you are really tapping into your intuition, your psychic abilities for the rest of the month. I feel like um, dreams are becoming very clear or very vivid. Um, a lot of, is happening in your sleep. Okay. Moon reverse though. And like you can see there's a book that's open. So I feel like there's some sort of information here that's coming to light. Some sort of secret knowledge. What is this secret information about? What's coming to light? Oh gosh. Okay. Ooh. Hmm. I'm seeing you starting to become aware of like someone's someone's uh I'm hearing attachment, someone's attachment, someone's uh, someone hasn't moved on from a situation, a toxic situation. Okay. You're realizing, oh snap, like some I thought that I thought this person moved on from this from this um toxic situation, but I guess not. Like someone lied, someone um wasn't wasn't being honest. But but I feel like with this high priestess in your energy, there's an essence of you kind of knowing, knowing a lot, but saying very little, having information in your hands, but just observing and seeing things play out. Because I feel like there's some sort of drama around you. I have ones drama around you. Someone's creating drama. Someone's still um, in a toxic cycle. And you're just sitting and watching. <laughs> Friendships is coming out. Okay. So... Someone secretly doesn't like another person. Someone secretly still um, end up coming from a place of 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 in, of instability, not being grounded. Okay, so yeah, I feel like you're starting to find things out in your in your circle, in your circle, in your friend group. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. I feel like someone's secretly upset with you. Someone's like secretly upset or has been holding a grudge because look at you. Six of Wands. Being celebrated, being victorious, um, being recognized and rewarded. And someone's in this like energy of still... I'm trying to like compete with you. Okay. I see you're realizing like the I see you realizing that something's just not worth staying in. You're withdrawing your energy emotionally or you're in the process of like leaving something behind in order to just focus on yourself without without um the negativity or without someone um coming towards you with with a wounded energy okay 
We, I do see someone heading towards you really quickly. What do they want? Taking action towards you. Trying to find a way to, to move something forward here. Okay. Interesting. They want a relationship. They want a relationship with you. They want to settle down and or create a family they they want happiness with you okay six of cups someone who you know someone who you know from the past or past life Okay, if you have someone in mind, think of them. Let's take a look and see how they feel about you. It's about the situation with you for the rest of the month. Okay, they're afraid. They feel like a fool. They feel like a fool. Interesting. They feel like... Them taking a leap of faith towards you, taking and and leaving behind fears is risky. But they're jumping through some sort of hoop to move something forward here. Yeah. I see this person taking action. It um Wanting to see you as soon as possible, wanting to meet with you face to face, wanting to move a situation forward as soon as possible. Where are they wanting to move this forward towards? The magician. Hmm. They want to move this forward to a deeper level of commitment a deeper level of love a deeper level of communication um d deeper level when it comes to actions okay why are they looking at cancer as a two of pentacles reversed okay so they see that you've stopped um, putting the effort in or uh, you've kind of lost control lost balance here but they still see you as having your heart open or feel like you you are willing to keep an open heart okay um, so I do actually see that this could lead towards a long-term thing with this Queen of Pentacles, with stability, with commitment. Um, also, like, I I see you, uh, some of you have always had this, like, inner feeling that you're meant to be successful or you're meant to be someone who is very stable. And... You are moving towards that success and stability in your life. And this is something that you've known for a very long time, or you've known this for years. You've known that this is who this is um, something that you're meant to have in your life, to be taken care of, to live a life above average, okay? But the Queen of Pentacles, she's also very self-made okay some of you are very self-made and you've been doing things in silent working in silent and now you're just about to pop out like yeah this is what i built something that you built in your life is being ready to establish itself i'm seeing a home okay with these nails and hammers some of you are building something solid 
maybe it's literally a home, but you're building something that is leading you towards, um, towards having that legacy for years and years and years. You're building a legacy for yourself and it feels like you're kind of doing it on your own right now. Or you're realizing that this is something that you're able to do on your own. Okay. But it's not to say that you won't have help along the way. Six of Cups. Someone who... Someone who you have a past life with is coming your way. There's a lot of passion as well. Passion, love, commitment, communication. Okay. Tell me more. Is there anything else that... Cancer needs to know. All is well. You're being initiated right now. Let go of who you were. Let go of who you were in the past. And embrace who you have yet to become. Who you are becoming. Who you've always known you were meant to be. I'm seeing the numbers 18, 5, 2, 6. Those numbers, they could be birthdays, special days, synchronicities. I'm seeing the letters H, L, S, F, N, A, P, S. Those letters could be in your name or someone else's. But with that said, this is what I'm seeing. If it did resonate, let me know. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you and, and your patience. And I hope you have a blessed day. Bye.